COVID-19 on the coast and it is back to school in April for public schools that are reopening in Santa Maria. And the morning news reporter Keith Carls joins us live in Santa Maria with the details. Good morning, Keith. Big day for a lot of these kids. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It is a big day. It's a big day for uh, public schools here in the Santa Maria Valley. Uh, as you mentioned, the elementary and high school districts are welcoming students back onto campus this morning under a hybrid model, we should point out. Uh, now, in the Santa Maria Benita Unified School District, the largest elementary school district in Santa Barbara County, about half of the kindergartners and first graders from each elementary school will return to campus this morning. That's depending on how many families choose to bring their kids back to school or keep them in distance learning from home. Now there are two groups for every grade level in the school district. Group A will come back on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Group B will come back Wednesdays and Thursdays. Students not on campus during the week will continue distance learning remotely with their teachers and classmates. Public safety protocols remain in effect. It includes mask wearing, temperature and health checks, classroom social distancing and other safety precautions. The district says each week additional grade levels of students will return for two days of on-campus learning until preschool through eighth grade students who choose to come back are receiving in-person instruction by May 10th next month. Now the Santa Maria Joint Union High School District is also welcoming uh, students back to campus this morning. It's starting with the senior class. Uh, seniors, students will be welcomed back uh, for those who choose to return for in-person learning uh, and it'll be phased in with the juniors, sophomores and freshmen. Reporting live in Santa Maria this morning. I'm Keith Carls. Joe, back to you. Now you got to be happy for those uh, high school seniors that have missed out on so much. Keith, thank you for that.